Welcome to my humble abode. I'm Yorkie the Tail Spinner and this. He sailed over coffee. We start the day together. A cup of coffee and an additive tail. We return now. To Telltales. Season 3. Episode 3. Where they've just been thrown out. Of the place they'd gone to. The new frontier place. We'll have to see what happens now. Come on, Trip. Close the door. Hurry. Get that goddamn Jack out of there. Found themselves a little safe that place, we close. hope. You can say that again. Hey, I'm here. David! Don't you dare let that fucking baby kill her in. Don't make me do this. He'll die. He has a son, Clem. Just like you did. She's trouble. She's with me. I owe her my life. She told us some pretty rancid stuff about you, man. What did she say? That you left her to die. No, we kicked her out. A little girl, all alone out there. Do you think Mariana could have survived that? We had rules. Clem broke them. Yeah, I need to find Mariana out. To anybody. Yeah. She knew what would happen. To anybody, huh? You broke the rules for Kate and Gabe. And I'll accept the consequences. Unlike her. Did he suffer? Please. I have to know. No. I wouldn't have let him. But I didn't have to worry about that. He lived. Oh, I wondered about that because we didn't see that he died. He lived. But how? He was dying. Clem said so. AJ bounced back. He was stronger than we thought. So I guess the meds did help. It was a miracle. You're lying. I don't know, Clem. I don't think he lied about this. You don't know him like I do. Clementine, please, I'm telling the truth. Where? Where is AJ now? I don't know for sure. But he's in Richmond? Dr. Lingard took care of the boy. He'll know how to find him. Oh, the freak who wanted him to die? Then nice I'm doctor. going back. None of us are going anywhere until the water's clear. Clem says, let me take care of that. <laughs> What's your plan, David? We used to store a vehicle up this way. Provisions. I came to get you set up. And? And say goodbye. I don't want you to worry about Kate and Gabe. I'll take care of my family from now on. They'll be safe with me. Fine. Take care of them. It's about time you stepped up. I had to think about that one because his family too and has feelings for Kate. He'd been running with Gabe almost like a, a secondary dad. But anything for his family is how it played him. And that being the case, he might feel that Richmond is safer for his family than being on the run. You got some nerve. <laughs> Shit. <Hoard it> up. <laughs> we need something to buffer. Something heavy. 
Heavy. There. Help me. Wait a half second. Where'd you find this? Over there. Show me. Property of Prescott. What the hell is all this? These could come in handy. Don't want to just take them, but I might be going crazy, but I think these came from Prescott. That's banter punch. I don't understand how all this got here. Like you don't know. Hey, none of this stuff was here before. I don't have a damn thing to do with it. We've only ever kept a few basic supplies here for scouts. Your people looted this stuff from Prescott, David. Come on, we can't know that. Who, Who else, else did you do with? Your outfit is the only one that gutted my town. This is bigger than just Prescott. There's spoils from other towns here, too. Towns I heard got raided a while back. There, there's stuff here from the kingdom. Take cover. Eat in this. Fuck him. I do that little bitch again just to see her head pop. You sure as hell are stupid, ain't you? You only just realizing that now? I told you. Joan is on the warpath. Last thing we need is people getting wind of all this stuff. Look at all this shit. We're freaking rolling in it. I'll give you that. Just glad we found some more smokes. That shit is the new gold. Shame you can't take it with you. David! I thought better of you, Max. I really did. Dave. Let me just check that ping. Let's take a quick break. Come on. Come on. Uh, I missed something. I should have done any at the end, is it? Oh. Come on. I didn't get to him quite in time. Alright, that these are my fault. The ones on the previous game, uh, uh, season, they were bad, but these are my fault. I had a really bad time sleeping last night, that's why. Let's get this done. The time to charm. Damn it! Might be four times the charm.
Come on. If I'd have known you were Dave's brother. Come on. I shoved that gas can down your throat and lit you up like a candle. Ugh. But this will do. One in the head, but it doesn't come back. Fucking Garcias! Oh. You, you, you shook my goddamn guts out. Yeah, now take his brain out before he turns. You're the worst kind of filth, Badger. This is how it had to end. Oh. Take him out in the brain. Bring it then. See if I can. See if I give a shit. Take the brain stem out. Easy, Conrad. He's already He's down. gonna die and turn. Remember my woman? Francine? You. You snuffed her out like she was nothing. <clears throat> she was... nothing. He's finished. Get it over with. Come on. What are you waiting for? We've gotta move. No point drawing it out. Back her up, Sunbeam. That's enough, man. He's gone. Get a goddamn hole in yourself. Making sure he doesn't turn, boy. There. Now we're safe. I hope that made you feel better. Why do you think you've been living high so long? What's that supposed to mean? I ain't got nothing to say. Start talking, or I promise you, you're gonna scream. Okay, okay, take it easy. I'm waiting. Come on, man. It wasn't like we were doing this by ourselves. Joe was in on it. We did it on her orders. She... She said we needed it to survive. I wanted to let you in, but she told me you'd never go for it. I'm, I'm sorry. It's too late for sorry, you bastard and shitbag. Please, don't kill me. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. Oh, bullshit. I'll help you get back inside. Who oh, you? I need your help. I'm begging you. Yeah, like we're gonna trust you. Where's Lonnie? He gave us the slip. Hightailed it back towards Richmond. Son of a bitch. If he warns Joan. What about the other two? Are they in a problem? Oh. Oh, come on, Clem. You're not going to let squeamish now. That son of a bitch killed Mariana. Did that make you feel better? I wouldn't shed any tears if I were you. Maybe I'm shedding them for your brother. Hey, man. Back the fuck off. I don't need a lecture from you. You need it from someone. You don't want to become the thing you hate. If he was stronger, he'd still be alive. He wasn't, so he isn't. That's that. <laughs> That's Sometimes my ass, Clem. no other way to make things right. My friend took a crowbar to someone once. 
My people need to know about what we found here. What about your missing friends? I'm surprised you care. Human life isn't exactly high on your list of priorities. Don't have time to keep looking. They'd want me to get home in the morning. So that's what I'm gonna do. Sooner the better. You sure you'll be okay on your own? To be honest, I think my odds are better than yours. I won't forget about it. You have my word. It's a shitstorm out there, man. I don't see how you're gonna make it. One step at a time. We need to get back to Richmond fast. <laughs> I have loved ones in there. We both do. We all do. I gotta break Eleanor out of there. Once she's safe, I... I'm gonna tell her how I feel. That time. You said it yourself. If it ain't messy, it'll be important, right? We're gonna need allies in Richmond. Lingard and Clint, they're our best bet. If I can get to them before Joan does, maybe we have a chance. I know I was ready to say goodbye before, but I can't do this without you. Can I count on you? I won't be able to pull this off myself. Family. Of course, David. You're my brother. I never forgot that. Even if you did. I'm glad to hear that, Javi. You and I, we should talk when this is done. I'm the lawn raises the alarm. They'll be waiting for us at the gates. There's a way in round back that'll get us around any sentries. We can take Badger's truck. I doubt he'll mind. Come on. We gotta get on the move. Herd's closing in. I think we might drive close to the end of the episode. Not sure, but... I'd imagine we're lining up for a big battle in the last one. Let's go. I'm thinking this will go a lot better if we split up. A group this big can't exactly sneak around. Particularly if they're expecting us. Eleanor's in there somewhere. I'm going after her. Then I'm coming with you. Lingard brought her to the clinic. That's your best bet. Javi, that's where you'll go to get Kate and Gabe. Then bring them to my house. It's the one with the raven on the hitching post. We'll all meet up there. After I pay a little visit to Joan. Stay out of sight. They'll be keeping an eye out for us. As soon as I can get Kate and Gabe, we'll see you back at the house. Roger that. I'll scout ahead. Wouldn't it be a better job if I'm scout ahead? I'm pretty sure I've still got some friends in the new frontier. If they know where AJ's being held, they'll tell me. As soon as I find him, I'm taking that truck and getting the hell out of here. Huh. You are owed a vehicle. <laughs> Keep an eye on David. I may be playing nice, but I'd still watch, watch your back. Give me a little credit, Clem. I can handle David. I really hope you're right. The only thing that matters is staying alive. See you when I see you. There goes Clem. David said to hang a ride up at that corner. Seems clear so far. Let's move. You know Javi Garcia? Used to play shortstop for Baltimore. That Javier Garcia? That's who we're looking for? Yeah. That Javier Garcia. Anyway, it sounds like some paranoid horseshit. Guy's a fucking ball player. There's the medical center. We go in, we get the out, out. we get Kate and Gabe, we get out. Right. Not that easy, man. We've seen them make haze before, and they ain't afraid to use them.
responding to those guards. The first and worst mistake you can make is underestimating your enemy. There's a lot of others too, of course, but... Damn it. We need a distraction. How's your throwing arm? Pretty good. Just taken out a window. <laughs> Hit the trick, didn't it? You guys find out. Tell her we're moving Kate. Sounds good. We'll meet you here. We thought you were... I was... super worried. Are you guys okay? They didn't hurt you, did they? No. We're fine. They said you guys were denied entry. It's true. We're on borrowed time. The people who run this place, they're ruthless. We have to move. Where's my dad? Is he coming? Don't worry, buddy. We're gonna go meet up with him. Excuse me? David has a house in town. He thinks we'll be okay, okay. there. Then let's go. Wait, Javi? While you were gone, this woman, Joan, came by. Uh oh. I felt like she was sizing me up. Uh -huh. It was creepy. She implied David was in trouble. Like he was no longer in charge. Yeah, well. She kept saying Gabe and I didn't need to worry, but it only made me worry more. Joan's been running this place behind David's back. She's pulling the strings. What do you mean? The people who shot you? Answer to her. She ordered raids on other settlements. We found all this stuff from Prescott. She was behind Prescott? Yeah. Dave is rounding up allies to confront her right now. Javi, I know you wanted to drive here, but this isn't our fight. We already lost Marty because of these people. Now? The whole place is about to become a war zone. We're not safe if we don't stop Joan. But we can't just let her get away with it. You're not hearing me. This is not our problem. It is. What's going on? Trip said we had to make David's house. We're not doing that. Stop. We're getting the fuck out of Richmond before it's too late. Getting out? You shouldn't even be sitting up. What? What about my dad? We can't just leave him. Gabe. We don't even know who he is anymore. We have to get away before he gets us all killed. But he won't know where we are. Again. I can't go back to how things were before. Oh, this I'm is sorry. tough. I just can't. He's going to scream if we don't stay with David. Go to David's house. Javi. It's the best bet we got. It's all we got. I've got a gun in the room they gave me. Sounds like we might need it. I'll come with you. We'll catch up with you guys. Sounds no, good. It ain't messy, it ain't important. You can handle two guys. Don't. I didn't see Clem with you guys. Is she okay? I know, I know. She's tough, but... I don't know. It'd be nice to hear she's all right. If we run into her, she could really use a friend right now. Yeah. Me too. Whether she lets you be a go. friend, I don't know. Okay. Okay. I shall let anyone in. That's questionable at this point. You know this is what David lives for, right? What? A brawl. 
I only ever saw him truly happy when he was talking about being at war. <laughs> the world gone to shit? I guarantee. That was the best day of his life. We were in the thick of it, Kate. If he thrives in this shit, that only improves our chances. Just because he likes it doesn't mean he's good at it. Well, that's a good point. I did get uh, the power ripped from under him by a, a usurper. It took your damn time. Huh? Come on, we have to hurry. What? Well, wait a second. David told us to come here. He's talking to the others now. Trust me, shit's about to fly. This gonna need our help. doesn't sound good. We gotta get on the move. Get them to safety first. Then we can go. This is the best way to protect them. This does not sound good. I'll be safe here. Don't worry. I'll come back for you. Both of you. You better. I don't let you tell me, David. If this is about your brother... Don't pretend like you don't know what this is about. You've got a lot to answer for. Me? You must be joking. Javi! Kate and Gabe? Safe. I knew I could count on you, brother. We're gonna fix this. Together. Of course. Kate and Gabe are safe. I got your back. Thank you. It means a lot that you do. What's going on here? We're just getting started. And despite what we all agreed, you smuggled your brother back into Richmond. Yes. What happened to you, David? It hurts me to see you betray your own people. You best listen up. You've got some damn nerve. We used to be so close. Now I hardly know who you are. David didn't betray anyone. He can be hard to deal with, but he's always been loyal. I wish I could say the same for you. What are you people talking about? So this is your play? First you accuse Badger, then you come after me. Would someone please explain what's going on? I can. Lonnie? Go ahead, Lonnie, tell us. They attacked us. Murdered Max and Badger. You son of a bitch. They would have got me too. I was lucky. Are you kidding me? You have the nerve to accuse us? Their bodies are in the factory. See for yourself. Why don't you tell them what you were doing up there, Lonnie? Tell them how Joan ordered you to kill and loot. Is that true, Joan? <laughs> it's nothing but a smoke screen. A pretty damn transparent one, if you ask me. Lonnie. Please, tell me this isn't true. Hmm. He didn't say we did it. that. Raided those communities. Hurt those people. Because David told us to. Oh! Not Joan. I'm sorry, David. I can't do this anymore. You fucking liar! David had nothing to do with this! No. I am done lying. This is the first right thing I've done in a long time. Who's dumb this back? Is He's covering for Joe. David, just stop. We knew this couldn't last forever. We confronted him. Me, Badger, and Max. We were done. We let him know. He said he didn't need us anymore. Not with his brother. All this had. went south. That's when he. That's when Badger Max. That's enough. David, stop. This bad. Oh, you have to stop her. Or the blood from those raids, it's on your hands. Don't let Joan get away with this. She's working you like a puppet, man. Can't you see that? Don't let yourself get played into doing something you regret. Maybe we should sleep off. <laughs> Give everyone some time to cool down. Oh, yeah, that's that's a great idea. No. <laughs> Don't try and drag him into your mess. The things you've done, they're an assault on what we built here. You and your brother, you're going to have to answer for them. 
I still have friends here. Allies. This uh, I wouldn't bet on that. Put this on yourself, David. I'm sorry to say it, but you're done here. They were our oh, family, God. David. Oh, oh God. His deputy's gonna come in with enemies to people to attack him. I'll give you family. Whoa. Oh, this is bad. You and six and two thirds of people demanded justice for Mariana's murder, yes. You and eight, almost all, one six didn't try and save AJ, more or less. Two thirds destroyed Badger's skull. Oh, we had to destroy his skull. I could have let him be killed quickly, I suppose. You and just under half killed Max. I watched David do it, but he deserved it. Just over half took to David's plan. Well, this has lined up for the next. I thought it. I didn't think it was going to go that south. Two episodes left. I was thinking it was the final episode coming up, but it's not. There's two episodes left. Well, enjoy your coffee and have a blessed day. Join me next time for episode four of season three, A New Frontier of Telltales of Walking Dead.